There are a few matters, though, which I wish to clarify. First, it must be clear that a deputy speaker is not a speaker. Indeed, Article 96 1. Article 96, 1 of the Constitution says, and I quote, There shall be two deputy speakers of parliament who shall be elected by members of parliament from among members of parliament. And if you contrast that with Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker is not a member of parliament. I am a member of parliament. The Honorable Second Deputy Speaker is a member of parliament. And our role is to assist the speaker in managing this house. So any attempt, are you, any attempt to read I'm not member. If you don't keep quiet, I will be forced to ask you to leave. Any, any attempt to read and interpret the constitution of Mr. Speaker to include the deputy speakers is a misreading and a misapplication of the constitution. But when Mr. Speaker is not available, either of us will preside on the House. So can any other member, if necessary. Any other member can be elected by the House to preside. It doesn't, that member does not lose his right to be a member of the House. That is what our standing orders say. 